tonight, joining us, the one, the only, I'm Marksman. Everybody give a round of applause. Uh, Internet should applause. Have troll. Should have trolled. I would have been like, tonight he we is. have seen Anders on the show. <laughs> no, he is... He is more popular than me. I would have picked him. He is vice president of Rebel Gaming. He is also renowned search and destroy gamer. YouTube phenom. Yeah, right. <laughs> I do stuff for fun. Oh, no. He's actually very good. In fact, he's so good that um, he, he, he rages with me. <laughs> <laughs> he is actually the person that got me to love Search and Destroy. I never played it before. I played it with Nick. And um, when he does, if I don't play well enough, he tells me that I pretty much suck in... <laughs> In a long, no, you don't ever say I suck. But no, it's you're about so lucky. other people. I just tell them they suck, and I'm not playing with them anymore. But it's about a paragraph long rant. <laughs> no, I give you the silent treatment of of how your KD is gonna suffer if you don't leave this game now. <laughs> oh, I never KD. Eh. MLG oh. MLG Blue. Oh. Honestly, please do not talk smack about him because he will own you in every way. What's I, I don't even, I'm not even reading it right now. Well, you should. Busy, MLG Blue says, s and Gamer, I'll ninja defuse you. Well, that's fine. Bring it. I don't care. <laughs> I, I don't ninja defuse anything. I play the objective. I arm it. I kill people. And that's kind of how I do it. And he's very good at what he does, or I wouldn't boast about him. Because if he sucked, I wouldn't sit here and say he was great. Yes, she would. She'd have to get me in trouble. Yes, he will own you. I'll put no, money on I'm it. I'm not going to own anyone. I don't want to play anyone in 1v1. I hate doing that stuff. What is, MLG Blue, what are you, freaking 8 or something? No, I'm joking. <laughs> he, he's actually, he's, he's, a good, he's a good kid. He's one of our Blue? regulars. Blue, yeah. Oh, I was going to say me? That's a lie. No, he's one of our regulars. He's, he's a little cocky at times, but we just usually just mute him. <laughs> now they're all calling you out. Well, that's not why we're here, so I hope you guys show um, Nick a little respect because he is the VP of Rebel, so. Asshole. Don't. <laughs> and um, I would expect um, some respect given there. Don't worry. No, I do I, worry. Don't want for any feelings. I don't like that. I don't care no. if they hurt your feelings or not. He's like, he is <laughs> like my little brother. I can kick his ass and call him names, but nobody else can. So you would never beat me in Call of Duty, though. So I, I won't. <laughs> no, I, I, oh, I know I couldn't. Kick ever. ass in that. Maybe in real life, I'll let her. I, I, I wouldn't hit her, so she would, she would <laughs> destroy would. me. <laughs> yeah. But, Robbie, kill Robbie. Yes. I'll, I'll yes. Sleep. And now everybody knows that Nick calls um my son Robbie. Yeah. The infamous oh. Rob oh. Selig. Oh. The senior vice president is called Robbie. So you me. guys can all tweet no at else. him. <laughs> all right. How many of you have been drinking tonight before we get started? <laughs> more you drink, the better the show is. Promise Absolutely. You. Malone's in the house. Hey, Malone, what's up? He is our actually our, our first VIP for Rebel Gaming. So he's a good... Good guy. He's been with us for a long time. Oh my God! Look who's in the house. The administrator for Rebel Gaming, Doxy. What the fuck brought you in here? I tweeted. Tweeted you. Your tweet. You tweeted. There we go. Oh wow! Everybody say hi to Doxy. Hopefully she has some news about our website. Oh Facebook. She saw it on. <laughs> <laughs> I tweeted. I mean, I went through. I use Hootsuite, so. Hootsuite. Uh, you know what, yeah, we, Carrie? Yeah, you should so. actually be on Skype with me and Nick. That's what yeah. you should be. You should drop in and say hi. Who uses Skype? We do all the time. I, I You're yeah, always right. on Skype. I use Uvu all day. My Uvu account. Who's we? Shinto. Who? What's this we shit? <laughs> I like how Shinto, uh, yes, I have an admin to my site. I have two. We have Afro Gamer and Doxy. She's also our web designer. <laughs> I'm teasing you. And um, and she takes care of our website. And I was hoping maybe in channel she could um, tell us some news on when our, um, when our uh, new website will be going up. So... So, Wait. any news on that, Carrie? 
type in yes. A different day. <laughs> yeah, a different day other than today. Some other time. Oh, she, we're waiting on um, actually Afro Gamer who needs to stop getting his. Yeah. He needs to get his winky out of his girlfriend for a weekend and dedicate it. <laughs> Dedic and dedicate Perfect. himself to us. <laughs> bros before hoes. Exactly. We are his bros. That's a lie. That's not hoes a lie. Hoes win every time. Hoes win it. That's every not time. true. Hoes do not win every time. Oh, very close to every time. <laughs> there are very few occasions bros go before hoes. <laughs> Okay. Next. Oh, Mike's going crazy. Get the wire. Whatever. Oh. Get the wire. wire. Is it? Wire. It, slap it. Is it? Is it better? It's better. All right. Thank you. I told you. All right. Thank you. All right. So, um. Hi. Actually, Rob sent me a link today, and it would freak me out for a minute because of the fact that he sent it from the Rub Gaming account, and I was just on the Rub Gaming account, and all of a sudden I got a link sent to my other account. But um, I want to show you guys a link in the chat room. And uh, Carrie confirms that our website will be changing soon. I hope so. I can't wait. It's, it's amazing. All right. Everybody in chat, click on that link and check it out. There's images of the new. Please not porn. Is pro it's supposed to be rumors of the new PlayStation. Um, the slip. Yeah, PlayStation 3 4000 series model. Yeah, how many slims do they need? I don't know. I'm quite happy. The Xbox needs to make a, like a be more unique. They're like, we have the Xbox Large. <laughs> All right? This won't fit in any backpack or any storage area. But it is very cool looking. It looks like a PC tower or something like that. It's, just, it's, it's enormous, and all it does is take a disc. And it just lights up like a spaceship and crap like that. It has no real function. <laughs> It still is light as a normal Xbox. I know, but you know what? I think I think the older model model PS3s are probably a little bit sturdier. The one we have is the newer, the like the new Slims. Right after they had made the the fatty, the originals, this was the first Slim that came out, and that thing has hit the floor. I can't tell you how many times that it doesn't break. It's just it's made really well. I'm afraid that this slimmer model will be too slim. It's too slim. You know, it's because the Asians are making it. Right? Carrie? Carrie's Asian. If she's still in here, she will <laughs> she will verify. It's because Asians have a thing with being thin. Unless you're a sumo wrestler. So, hey, it's Kenny. See? See that? Our Asian admin, Doxy, confirms it's because Asians like thin things. <laughs> so, so because uh, we thought about the same thing right there when you mentioned that. No, no. <laughs> These Asians like thin things. I'm like, ah, I'm sure they do. Nokia, yeah, I'm thinking Nokia all day. Sure. Oh boy. <laughs> so I don't know. I I still think that I'm happy with our. We've had it for three years. I've had no problems with it ever. Um, I would be. I had 64 for 10. Work. I know, but I, you know, I just, Don't I don't know. think they're gonna make the newer models. Like, like you said, how many slims do they need? Like, really? Well, I just got absolutely destroyed by Asmodon. That was. By the way, as we speak, Nick is multitasking. He's. Playing I'm finishing Diablo a run on Diablo. Because mm -hmm. for some reason, he doesn't know how to tell time. <laughs> so. No, after 15 minutes of her being late, I. Determined oh, I was doing TJ's oh. birthday cake. Be nice. Um, sure, Good. Kenny, if you want to come on. Jump on Skype. Kenny is going to join us on Skype. Um, we actually do. Actually, um, wait, I got to pull up my uh, Skype. Oh, Kenny. Here. Who's he? Um, hey. Kenny UFG. Um, he was, uh, he was big around, um, Jenna's, uh, events that we did. Oh. And he uh, has his own site that he kind of runs. So I might know Kenny, maybe. You might know him. I am uh, just, we're going to get him in here, and uh, there's no, well, there is, well, you don't get cake, Blue. <laughs> there's no cake for you. <laughs> I give everybody else cake but Blue. <laughs>
All right. I am going to, um, as soon as I see you pop on, Kenny, I'll add you in chat. And uh, Malone says he'll be more than happy to share his cake with everybody. <laughs> oh, it's ice cream cake, by the way. It has little crunchy things in the middle of it. It's really good. It's so good. I'm eating it right now. Get out of here. No, it's not disgusting. It is the most wonderful thing in the world. You should be. I am. I am. Shut up. I am eating it and enjoying it. And I'm eating live on air. <laughs> All right. So um. So the other thing that I wanted everybody. Um, God, I don't even know if I can find it. I'm going to actually have to have one of you guys go find this for me. Um, um, Blue can go find this. Uh, Blue, go find um, the Medal of Honor um, Warfighter trailer, the newest one that they put out. Yeah, I've actually seen some good things uh, that. That was, like, fucking brilliant. I honestly was, like, in tears. I see, I've seen some pretty good uh, Medal of Honor Alpha gameplay already. I, I'm just... I'm so blown away. I, some of the bigger places are saying it's going to, um, it's going to give Battlefield a run for its money. Yeah, well, Battlefield is too hard to beat. So. No, well, you know, I mean, it's it's comparable. Um, is that well, it? Battlefield's fun for like Shinto? one day, and only if you have friends that play Battlefield. If your friends don't play Battlefield, Battlefield's not fun. No, the the new gun game they have in there. Well, it's not gun game. This is, is this the video or is this, yes it is. Scroll down and guys, watch that video and then as soon as everybody tells me they watched it, we'll discuss it because <laughs> it makes me want to cry when I see it. It's so beautiful. Like seriously. Let's have a picture of me in it. <laughs> oh, the video was removed. Why don't you find us a link that works? Yeah, find a real link. Find a real, like, why did you try to find the YouTube link? No, 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 oh, no. Jesus Christ, you need something done. I'll go to rubgaming.com. Oh my god, they have it. <laughs> Never been to that site. <laughs> it's true, too. <laughs> I could ask Nick anything about the front, what the front of Rep Gaming looks like, and he will have no fucking idea. <laughs> They're like, yeah, we got some shit on there, I think. Nick, how many how many of your videos do we have up on the front page? I don't know. <laughs> I want to say somewhere near 25. <laughs> not on the front page, but... Oh, not on the front page. That's all we got on that. No, today, how many do we have videos of yours? Today? Uh-huh. On the front page. two. Oh, I do. Yeah. Very That's just because we talked about it earlier. Not that I looked at it. I know. <laughs> he didn't look at it. No. <laughs> <laughs> you suck. Hey, my Skyrim good. video, pretty damn good. I know, I have to put that up still. I wasn't able to do anything today. Oh, you didn't put that up? No, I'm really good at guessing because I thought you put that up. No, I, I put two of your videos up. And yesterday I'm really good. Up. You've been putting up a lot lately again. Thank you. I got back home. I was gone for a month, two months. What were you doing while you were gone? Back home. So tell us some of your videos that you've been doing. They suck. Don't watch them. Oh my god, they don't suck. He's so <laughs> like humble about everything. They're good. No, no, I'm Fine, I'm the best player ever. All right. You are. <laughs> I don't know. They're okay. They'll just be searching a strike. I like to. Here it is, guys. Medal of Honor Warfighter Fire Team multiplayer gameplay trailer. That's a they mouthful. Really should have short that one. Yeah, they should have. But here it is. In link for everybody. I need everybody to go to Rub Gaming and look at it because it's better on my site. <laughs> <laughs> And honestly, it is probably, it, it is honestly, uh, I'm going to mute, but i got to watch it. I'll cry just watching it because it's just so fucking good. I've loved this game, though, from the get-go. When IGN gave it the worst review ever on the face of the earth, I said they are out of their minds. I, I thought Medal of Honor 2010 was a great game. It had issues like most all first-person shooters do. You know, we want to talk yeah. about one of the first-person shooters that had probably some of the most epic issues when it first came out for PlayStation, even, and that was Black Ops. I mean, it was just—it was 
horrible. And I know for a fact because I sat on freaking I sat on that game in lobbies with David Vonderhaar while he tried to fix them. He'd call people off of Scott or off of Twitter, and we'd sit in lobbies forever and ever and ever. And that man busted his ass to try to fix everything, but the issues were horrible with it. But if you're watching this trailer right now for Medal of Honor, it's like, oh my god, it gives me it gives me chills. No, like like honestly, like I get this like warm feeling in my chest when I watch it. <laughs> Can't wait. Have a good time. <laughs> oh my god. It could be considered a heart attack. Yeah. That one you know, one. honestly, you guys, I need to be, like, live on the air when they release these, because you guys would fucking crack up if you saw my response, for real. Like, I get, like, giddy. Like, I'll sit there. Oh, there we go. You tweeted it. I was waiting for a tweet with the link. I just didn't retweet the one earlier. There we go. No, it's in channel. No, IGN. All right. I'll get you in chat. IGN, um, IGN sucks balls. I pretty much always said that. But um, because I think Medal of Honor, I think because IGN gave them a bad rap on Medal of Honor, I think it, it I did, I think it did hurt their sales. Because that, the day that game was released is the day they came out with their review. Nobody else had a review out but them. And it kind of, um, um, Kazuki says in channel about it, wow, that was, see, everybody says it's an amazing, the trailer was amazing. And it is, um. People are saying it's going to rival Battlefield. Of course, Nick doesn't think Battlefield is anything special. I won't play either. It doesn't make a difference. But I you you it. will play it because I'm going to get it for you. You're going to play it with me. I only played Medal of Honor at E3 in 2010, and that was the only time I ever played it. I played three games, I killed everyone, and then I was done. You're going to play this with me because because you're going to hurt my feelings if you don't. I <laughs> I'm gonna will be willing to sacrifice that. <laughs> Lots. You're not gonna play Warfighter with me? Are you serious? No, Warfighter is. Is that like a race car game? Yeah, you're. you're, Warfighter. Warfighter is gonna be the is the new Medal of Honor game that's coming out. I forgot the end of it because it was too long of a title. Oh, you know what? I can only remember the acronym. M O H. All right, you're pissing me off now. (laughs) (laughs) That's why I love you on here. All right, I'm trying to add Kenny into into our chat here. I'm sure he's impatient and has lots to say. All right, let's dial him in. I'm not hanging up. Now. You're not gonna fucking hang up. I'll try. No, you're not. You're on for good. I'm off the game anyway. No, I'm getting it for you. It doesn't matter. I'm off Diablo. Oh, okay. Well, you're gonna play. You're gonna play the other game with me. Hey, Ken, are you here? Hello, hello. Hey, guys. Hey, there he is, Kenny. Everybody say hi to Kenny. He is at hey, Kenny at Kenny UFG on Twitter, for those of you who don't know. I've known Kenny for a little over a year now, I guess. Probably, right? Yeah, just about. Just about. Maybe just a year. But, um... I've known Kenny for 10 seconds. How you doing, no. Kenny? <laughs> Hey, what's going on, Nick? <laughs> but yeah. I was on um, Twitter when they put this um, the Warfighter gameplay video out, and and me and Kenny probably had the same reaction. Um, we peed our pants pretty much when we saw it, <laughs> and Kenny was like, "I have to come on your show and talk about it with you." <laughs> so, Dude, it, oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I, right? Were we not, like, freaking out on Twitter over this game? It was so... I was like, wait, is that in-game? It looks like a freaking action film. Uh, it does. It, yeah, it was awesome. Awesome is, like... I think I think maybe... I think finally maybe um, they have people concerned, like, when they release this. <laughs> yeah, now, you know what the question is, though? The question is, will it give Black Ops 2 a run for its money? Hmm? I... I think off of sheer hype, I don't think so. But in terms of quality, maybe, especially with the multiplayer, if it if it if it's like, you know, what they showed in the trailer, I definitely think so. Um, but you know, off of sheer hype, Call of Duty has been oh yeah kind of up there. I think that's why Call of, that's why Black Ops Two went the route it went. I think they have to keep it going. I think I think as even though they're hyped, I think their hype is losing steam. 
Yeah, I think, um, well, I mean, because it's not, I mean, granted, I'm, I'm excited for Black Ops 2. So am I. I'm um, gonna get it. But I think it, one of those things is that, well, Black Ops, I think, is really cool because they're doing something different, whereas the Modern Warfare is starting to get, or has gotten, kind of stale, I guess. Mm -hmm. Um, I think so. And so, a lot of shooters are, you know, everyone's looking at other shooters Back. now. They're looking at Battlefield. They're looking at, you know, uh, Medal of Honor. Um, I want to go shoot about... space monkeys next. <laughs> Somebody better take one of these games. Better take me in space. I don't mean like Halo. I mean like I want army men in space. <laughs> that would be crazy. Yeah. What do you think, Nick? Yeah. About Black Ops Two and and the whole hype thing. Nick, are you with me? I'm I'm around. Yeah, what's up? <laughs> Black Ops Two. <laughs> You're such a dick. <laughs> <laughs> I was I'm making a pizza too right now. Well, then um, tell me you're making food, dude, and I won't ask like, you questions. I thought it'd be funny if you're like, Nick, are you there? And it's just complete silence. Uh, well, like, that's pretty much what just happened. No. Uh, <laughs> this is Black Ops. No, we were talking about how... Shooters and Black Ops 2 is what I heard. Call of Duty is kind of getting stale. That's why they went the route they went. No, they they played, they they cater to casual players. Casual players suck, and there's a lot of... All right, well, there you that's go. Crazy. They make it easy. They make it really easy. Like it's so it's it, it's almost too easy. I can play with my eyes closed at this point because I can sound for so easily with Mr. Pro. Oh wow! <laughs> you are amazing. No. Nick. They made it too easy. It's boring. Then why don't you play Battlefield with me? I don't want to go buy another game. That requires me to drive, find a store nearby. The new maps are amazing on Battlefield. I love them. Yeah, I, I did no really. I'm I had to wait quite a while for him, but um, a friend of mine at EA finally remembered me, and <laughs> after I'd only said nine thousand times how I didn't have it, but um, but he he had actually given me one, and I I love it. I really do think that um, every once in a while I go back and I play Black Ops because makes I, Battlefield I, dice. What what was that? Who makes Battlefield? EA? Yeah. Dice? I don't know who the hell. Dice does yes, or EA? Yes, EA. What, what does Dice make? Why do I have Dice in my head? I don't know. What? Uh, somebody in channel will... Well, didn't Dice do the uh, the multiplayer? I think so. For uh, Metal of Honor? Um... I swear to God, Dice does something involved with that. <laughs> Dice does something. There's no reason I would know this company name if, I, if they didn't do something with the game that's like... Who's in there with you? Talking, Nick. I like, oh, that's, Dice does mirrors, I, that's my roommate. Uh, I gotta Google it. I gotta know what Dice, what the hell does Dice make? Dice, Dice makes the multiplayer, says Blue. They just make multiplayer? Um, come on guys, get it right in chat. I count on you guys to give me the shit that I need. <laughs> You're fucking slacking tonight, you regulars. See if I give you t-shirts when they come in. <laughs> Now Nick is having to Google when he's just supposed to sit here and watch the chat. I, I Googled it and it didn't pop up instantly, so I gave up. Metal, yeah, Medal of Honor oh. uses Frostbite. Uh, Medal of Honor is actually using um, not Frostbite this time. Um, well, DICE did the first the Battlefield games. Okay, I then, the last Battlefield game right. I played was back in 22. So. Alright, well, you, you're, I'm going to get it for you again, and that's that, because you need to play with me. Because when, as soon as I start streaming, you're gonna come and play with me while we stream. I play on a computer before I play no. on. No, no, you no, you're gonna play it on Xbox because I'm gonna buy it for you and you're gonna play with me. Hey. I'm older. I win. Period. <laughs> Younger. We we argue like. <laughs> I have more followers. I win. I I don't give a shit if you have more followers. Why well, I win then? No, you Thank don't. You. I'm older. I win. More subscribers. I win. No, I don't give a shit if you have more subscribers. Your videos suck. <laughs> no. More contact myself, I win. <laughs> you'll do it, or you'll hurt my feelings. So. I have more socks in my drawer. I win. You have more socks in your drawer. Is that what you just said? Hey. <laughs> You're an asshole. <laughs> I'm a better asshole. I win. Oh my god! Shut up. Fine. You're gonna play with me, anyways. So. Anyhow, I thought that um. Okay, it's just an affiliate. Yeah, I found out. I found out. 
Dice is best known for Battlefield and Mirror's Edge. So there we go. My roommate found it. Somebody else in channel said right. Mirror's Edge. Suck it. No, that's why I said that. What they did. That? Somebody else in channel said Mirror's, Mirror's Edge. Uh, yeah, I said that. The Mirror's Edge, but they didn't say they did Battlefield. They did a map pack. They did all around. They, they made Battlefield like map stuff. Shinto said, yeah, so "I like Dice Mirrors. Dice's Mirror's Edge." Shinto said they, it up above. They did that as well. Okay, well I was saying he did mention it. You want to fucking fight? <laughs> no, I said that they um they made battle the Battlefield games and uh they and the Battlefield Three. Okay, so they, they, you guys kept saying older Battlefield games. It's like, well, shit, how old are they? They've only got Battlefield Three. They had Battlefield Bad Company Two and Bad Company. So they had Battlefield nineteen forty two. I think yeah, that's what it's called. That, that and I think you guys too. Let's see about that one. Vietnam was uh, back to the two. Also. Go to Wikipedia. They have everything. I don't care. It's all good. <laughs> <laughs> That's very nice of you. I know. It's supposed to. I know. You're a dork. So, that said, we all, um, I don't know that many people fucking, I'm very unhappy with people not watching that video. But, Why? um, well, because I just thought it had more hits on Stumbled Upon, and it didn't. So I'm going to have to spam it again under a different link. That's all. Anyhow. Ah, oh, shit. You know what? I just cleaned my computer, and so I don't um, have my login that I usually do. Oh, God damn it. I did that, too. Actually, I had to uninstall and reinstall Chrome to fix an issue with a Java plugin, and I found out that it wasn't actually an issue, and I had to go under Chrome's separate Java updates, whatever, and disable, for some reason, Chrome has a separate Java than my actual computer, it likes to use its own. Right. I have disabled the private Java it was using for Chrome, it's used my backup on my computer. I don't know what it was, it was screwing everything up, so I was trying to do it. Wait, I think I got it. I saved it in Chrome. Please let it be it. Please let it be it. Yes! I found it! Okay. But, um... All right, so we all agree, though, that Warfighter is, um, yes, going to give other first-person shooters a run for money this No, we fall. don't all agree. Don't say that. I don't agree. Well, <laughs> well, you were making your pizza then, and that's what we said. I don't agree. Well, it's then don't walk away. Run for money. I, I, call of Duty is too easy. All the people can play it. No, I'm not saying that. We we said hype will will have Black Ops 2 winning because of hype alone. People will buy that game. Yeah. They, they'll sit and say how much they fucking hate it, but they're going to buy it anyways. No, yeah, I'll, I'll hate it before I buy it. I'll hate it after I buy it. I'll I know, but it. you'll still buy it. That's what oh, we're saying, but I think... But there's a difference. I'll hate Battlefield, or I'll hate Battlefield 3 and Medal of Honor, and I still won't buy it. I'll just hate it. Because I'll buy it for you, <laughs> and then you can hate it. You're a dick. Same but thing as Halo. I'll hate on Halo, and play Halo, and buy Halo, but I'm not going to do that with Medal of Honor. I'll just wanna, hate it. You want to fucking be boxed into your little games, that's fine. I actually yeah. sat here in my chair and I made a box with my hands as I said that. Because you got upset <laughs> me. Yeah. Because you won't well, play with me. Battlefield 3, says, is, Battlefield 3 is mostly played by Euros. All the Europeans play Battlefield 3. That's, well, a lot of them do, but a lot of most of the people that I've played with, even hit. in random lobbies. Oh, by the way, Get this, you guys can tweet, all of you in channel, tweet this out there too. I have decided after gaming with a few, in a few random servers, um, the other day, um, I gamed in one, and this team repeatedly lost against me, I came in, and I'm not trying to brag because I'm a mediocre gamer, but I came in the top three every round that we were playing, and every time this kid would kill me, he'd teabag me every time, so I finally got irritated, and I sent him a message, and I said, Yes, keep teabagging me because it helps me kick your ass every game. And he would not come in the top three. So he stopped doing it. But I said, you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start like rating like servers and start making a post about them on the site and talk about them on the show. So we're going to do like a thumbs up or thumbs down. I haven't sorted it all out, but I'm going to tell people what servers to avoid because they have douchebaggery shit going on in them and what servers should go and be gamed on. I'm going to become like the food critic nobody wants to see in the restaurant. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, oh my god, he's here. That's what I'll be. People see me, they'll kick me out of the server before I get to play. 
But I played I played on like two really good ones that I, I forgot to um, add them to my favorites, so I was kind of disappointed. And then I gamed on like, and oh, you know what, dudes? If you're gonna have your own server, fucking talk right. Don't replace th with a d. I don't want to see that shit is reals. I I don't want to see that as a join your <laughs> server. It's just fucking annoying. And they have like, oh my god. I don't, it's just the shit sometimes I see on these servers is just unbelievable. And my imagery that goes along with things that are said like that is not good. So do yourself a favor, and if you want people to play on your server, at least at least speak your language. And I don't mean, like, barbarian or whatever, <laughs> whenever they're speaking, whatever that shits may be. But um, ML... MLG Blue says, oh my god, the grammar of some people annoy the living shit out of me. Yes, me too. But, um, there's Nick leaving and coming again, as you can tell. He's running around. I'm making a pizza. He's making pizza. We had pizza tonight, too, for <laughs> TJ. Taco pizza. See, look at Shinto. He says, no way, I'm the admin. Oh, yeah. Yes, that's how this... <laughs> That she crazy. <laughs> yes. Oh my god, it's so true. And it, that was one of the servers I joined, and I was just like, I was waiting for like gangster rap to start playing, and and it was just a bad scene. I ended up actually leaving because both sides sucked, and I don't know what they were doing. They just weren't playing the objective, and I kind of raged on it and um, left. But like I said, I think that's going to be one of my new things is um, every week. I'm also going to um, shout out um, noobs, their gamer tags. I'm just going to fucking rat on your asses from now on. I actually added somebody. I told him I was going to I was going to mention him on the show last night, forgetting that it was a zombie show, and I don't usually do that except for like zombies. And being I don't know any zombies, I I don't give shout outs. So um, what was his name like? His name was like unloved something and he kept sending me messages every message was like okay no tj it was not untouched wiener would you shut off <laughs> the kids wow. i know that's my son um uh, his name oh, random. was it a random xbox generated yeah okay. no i was i was gaming and i joined and i'm sure as well if there are any if there's any you know, girls gaming, they'll know when, when you join a server. Girls gaming. <laughs> shut yeah, up. When right. you join a, a server, like, you, <laughs> oh, this used to happen a lot of, on, like, Black Ops and Modern Warfare 3. Like, you instantly get messaged by people, add me. Smiley face, <laughs> you know, emote with the winky. That's how I know, added, just, yeah. I know. <laughs> you did not. I had dick pics. <laughs> You're such an asshole. You did not. But, so this kid does this, and he's like, you should join our party and I was like oh that sounds like a, not a good idea him. did you do it did no do I it? didn't I didn't because he was doing he was doing um, glitches in battlefield and I was like no I'm here to play a game and, he, and that's what I tried to explain to him when I game sometimes I only have a limited amount of time and I don't have time to sit and watch you do a fucking glitch but I didn't say it like that because I wasn't that mean to him because I have to be nice to some people <laughs> <laughs> so but he read my <clears throat> Excuse me. He read my... Ah! Now I've lost my voice. <laughs> Completely <laughs> lost my voice. Thank you, TJ. <laughs> Water. We'll laugh at you. <laughs> okay, thank you. You got that. But, um... <laughs> but he was. See, they were... They had found a glitch on the one new map in Battlefield, and they were going up on top of the building. <clears throat> and that's not what I was there for. I hate that when they're like, "Hey, hey, watch this! Watch this glitch!" <laughs> you're like, I, I just, I kind of want to play. Well, uh, I, yeah, that's me. And I was like, "Well, I'm playing the game." And then when I realized that honestly they weren't going to be playing, I actually left that server and I went and played. And he kept messaging me. So his name on Xbox is Unloved Sam, and um, it's Unloved Space Sam. So everybody can send him a message and say hi. I did add him on mine, but I will not. That's Brett. I will not. Well, when he did game, he seemed like he knew what he was doing, but I think he was trying to impress me with his, um, with his way of glitching. <laughs> like, let me impress this girl. <laughs> yeah. And show her how I can glitch. 
Oh, I do too. <laughs> That's how Nick gets all the girls. Yeah, I, I go up. My KD is on my resume too. <laughs> <laughs> Nick puts his KD on his resume. Definitely. <laughs> Robbie's sitting up here. Everybody in channel, say hi to, say hi to Robbie. Nick's BFF. He's like, don't, Where is he? don't, don't. He's sitting. Only Nick can call him Robbie. The rest Where is of he? You. He's right behind me. Why? You want to say hi? Yeah. Okay, just hold on. Here. Say hi. What's up, pumpkin tits? You suck at Diablo. You know what, dude? Fuck you. All right. <laughs> I will go on right right now. It's still, when, bro. When's, P still. When, when's PvP coming out? <laughs> you don't want to know that. <laughs> I've been giving you all your armor. I'll know what you have. No, you haven't. You've given a quiver. That's about it. No, the like quiver was way better than yours. Sento, <laughs> <laughs> you spelled it wrong. It's R O B B I E. <laughs> I don't know, maybe I'll get on. Who knows? Maybe. Who knows? Okay. If he comes out, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> Turn your game to kill you over and over and over. All right, you got him all embarrassed. He's blushing, Nick. I don't know what you said to him, but oh, it was flattering. I'm sure. I know it was. Well, anyhow, so um, so why don't you tell us, Kenny, what uh, what you've been up to on on your site and stuff? Give your give your site a little exposure via our show, because that's how I roll, bitch. Oh, no, no. <laughs> Appreciate it. Um, yeah, I've been. It's it's interesting. Um, after we did the, uh, you know, the, the I guess, teletron, I guess of you know the hope for Jenna thing. Right. Um, you guys helped out a lot. I got a lot of followers and a lot of people coming to the site, and and then all of a sudden it just kind of blew up. Like I started getting, you know, uh, uh, hits from like Rockstar Games and cool. and Square Enix and you know. I'm like, wow, this is great. But then I realized I don't have as many writers as <laughs> you needed. I, yeah, you know, as I used to have. So I'm like, I've been losing my mind trying to review all these games in a timely manner. Um, but I'm not, I'm not upset. You That's know, always I'm a happy. good problem to have. Exactly. Right? Exactly. Plus, it's always cool to get free games. So you know. Yeah, um, absolutely. But yeah, we're trying to right. eventually uh, expand to a new site. Hello, can you hear me? Oh, are you? That's... I hear you. I'm doing a pizza. All right, he's eating a pizza, everybody. He's eating a pizza. Oh, Nick's getting his pizza. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but um, but well, that's good. Yeah, we're actually um, kind of the same thing has happened to us. And I think I, you remember when I tweeted to everybody that we had hit like ninety thousand hits for the month, which it was, was bananas. that was craziness. And uh, so we've been, we're actually, that's why Carrie came in and gave us an update. Hopefully this week, um, Rebel Gaming's getting a complete overhaul. Nobody's going to recognize it. It's so, it's getting, uh, plastic surgery is an understatement. It's awesome. Yeah, it, it looks a very, very grown up. I am. Coming out of its adolescence, finally. Nope, not. No, we're not going through a Michael Jackson thing. <laughs> We're not getting a nose job and all that stuff. Um, well, would you shut up? Oh my god! <laughs> good news. Good news. <laughs> Batman trailer came out. That was pretty cool. Yeah, let's talk about the Batman trailer. I missed. I it. haven't seen it yet, but it looked cool. Okay. You haven't seen it yet, but it looked cool. What it the fuck? Cool what I does was... that mean, Nick? I haven't, I haven't watched the trailer, but it looked cool when I saw it on YouTube. Oh, I only go on YouTube to upload a video and look at my videos. For... So, Blue, go find the new Batman video and post it in chat. That's your job. Get That's on it. way too much work. I'm on a tab already. Yes. Yes, oh, MLG Blue is our chat bitch. Yes. <laughs> Close the ad. Open the ad. Here we go. I got it. Oh, wait. Nick's got it. Post that in chat so we can watch it. And it's nice being able to watch all these videos for the first time together. We can all see I have it. no clue. It just led me to the website for it. I just want to know. God. You get free nothing, Blue, and you'll like it. I'll make you pay fucking double what everybody else <laughs> pays. <laughs> I love you, Blue. You know it, kid. Okay. Man, no, there's more. It's stuck. It's broken. I was going to ask you, yeah, like, last night when we were on for the zombie show. Okay, it's good. Don't touch it. 
All right. Life. Did he get the link already for that? No, he didn't. Good. I got the link. All right. Post the link there. By the way, everybody, if you guys didn't know it, um, I'm Nick um, actually works for Twitch TV as well. So. Oh, awesome. Yeah. So he's not only of our, our vice president and YouTuber, he's employed. <laughs> <laughs> That's always good. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Nick likes to have his tentacles in lots of people's pots. I like to work. I <laughs> know that sounds wrong, and I don't even know what kind of analogy that Watch was. Watch it but... out. It's crazy. <laughs> well, that's a good thing. That's how you you, uh, you build relationships. You know that that kind of help you in the future by like you know getting into everybody else's stuff basically. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna. Um, I'm gonna mute it. I'm gonna watch this for the first time right now. Oh my god, brand new Star Trek 2 teaser trailer. Click now. Oh, watch that too. I know. Let's watch movies together, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I'm watching the Batman. The Dark Knight Rises official movie trailer is what we are watching. We're all wa we're, Me and Rob are watching it in silence, though, because then I won't be able to hear anything else. Yeah. So it needs to be very impressive. To deaf people is what I'm thinking. <laughs> 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 you know, if if I was deaf, it would. That was my favorite part. The shadow. Oh, how come they're always at a masquerade ball? Can I just ask everybody that? There's a lot of balls around. No, only in Batman <laughs> movies, there's a lot of balls around. <laughs> oh, you're trying to buy a lot of balls, okay? <laughs> Is, uh, everybody in chat better be watching this because this is what we're about to talk about is this trailer right here look at the orange suits I can't wait to see this actually I can no <laughs> I'm, <joking>. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I, you know what I, I usually don't go see a lot of movies I wait till they come to my TV yeah I, just because I'm busy oh wow look at that football field sinking dude you better run faster than that touchdown He's thinking he did that shit. That's funny. Ew. <laughs> Dead people. Next summer. <laughs> what do you mean, uh, fucking next summer? Oh, this it's, is an old trailer. That is an old trailer? Oh, that's the only trailer I've seen. Yeah, this is, uh, this is back in... Oh, uh, you suck, December. Nick. Nick oh, gets a boo cool. and a hiss. That, who's, Kazuki says Batman loves balls. Hey, we're talking about that. What was that? Batman could be gay, TJ says. I should still get the pizza out. Fear back. Go Shit. get Nick's, um, actually. Um, Nick is get. Shut up. Nick is getting his pizza right now, everybody. So, there are people that are on Skype wanting us to say hi to Nick. Why don't they come in and say hi to him themselves? He took, who took, whose job? Shinto, you had a ball job with Batman? <laughs> Is that what you're talking about? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm teasing. You know, we actually do, um, on the site today, um, let me get to it, um, our wonderful, if you guys were able to join us last night, um, Barry was on with me from the UK, and today he put out, oh my god, can you stop that dog from fucking drinking? He's so loud. Holy shit, Cooper! God damn it. Sorry, my dog was drinking so loud it was annoying. I couldn't, like, ignore it. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, on our site... Um, oh, my God. Can you hear Nick is back now, everybody? What's up? <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> what? Oh, wow. You, like, come back so loudly. We, you, we like, can hear you. you. your mic. You do. Fuck that phone, you losers. <laughs> Yeah. Everybody, that is an exclusive interview with Dead Space 2 character Dan Emerson. And 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 yeah. Barry nailed that interview. He got that interview with him. And for the first time ever, that interview did not have a question about me in it. And I thank Barry for doing that. I am going to be in the next Dead Space 2 also. I will be what's the main character. I don't, I know. <laughs> I don't know anything about this. You're gonna be you're gonna be the next Dead Space, really? 
No. No, no, tell us more, please. <laughs> Expand. <laughs> I, I, I would love to. I mean, I'm just being stupid. Wish Who I is more about that space to elaborate. Uh, the new Batman trailer for us. Blue has just posted the new Batman trailer. Um, the new Batman trailer for you noobs is how he um, has referred to you all. <laughs> so, I think he was referring to you, Nick. What's going to change? Remember, Blue, Nick is staff here, so he can do things to you in chat that we can't. <laughs> no, I'm teasing. He won't abuse his powers, ever. Nick's not like that. Yeah. Yeah. Sure, I'm not. <laughs> Condescending Wonka. Yes, please tell us more. <laughs> <laughs> So, um, let's watch the... Who's watching the new Batman trailer right now? I am. Watch the other one. I was happy oh, enough. Oh, no. You gotta watch this one. I could already tell nope. by the picture. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Even the credits are even fucking amazing rolling into this. Rob yeah. says his mind's blown already just by the intro. Oh, the plane. That about a lot of I'm showing up. There... <laughs> wow. He says that you said that about a lot of things he's shown you. <laughs> My mind's blown. Again. Again. I don't know. There's a, this guy is very scary. Rob wants a mask in this. There's football fields, running, shooting. It's similar to the one Nick just showed us. Yes. There's a bridge collapsing. <laughs> two bridges collapsing. There's kids on a bus. Kids um, on a bus. Like a there's a man crawling up a wall. Another man screaming. Man with the mask. I'm I'm doing commentary. <laughs> man falling down a well with a rope. Hope is lost. There's a mark. There's still no Batman, by the way. He's not in this next one. <laughs> <laughs> there is shooting. There's a motorcycle being ridden. There's a man running in water. There's a guy in the mask. Faith is broken. Guns being fired. Batman! There he is! That's just an illusion. That's an illusion. A fire will rise. That's, that's what Robbie says when he's with Nick. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm teasing. If you're watching that video, it said, a fire will rise. And I said, that's what uh, Robbie says to you, Nick. All the time. Every time. Every time. The epic All day, every day. All day, air day. Catwoman. People Good. in the streets. Garbage trucks. Flying things. The Batmobile. It's sick. <laughs> Dark oh, night. Mike's freaking out. Okay, get, 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 nope, get away! Okay. What get the it. fuck, TJ? Get it. I'm sorry, my son just showed me the most grossest thing ever. His friend's finger was literally, the skin was torn off the bone. So, it was pretty gross. It was yeah, nasty. don't tell me that. I don't want to see it. Oh, I'm going to make, I'm tell Pete, TJ, fucking send that to Nick. He wants to see it. Don't send it. That was nasty. I was like, this is my, this too. is, but the skin was taken from his, like, the inside of his hand out towards the tip of his finger. It was all crunched up. It was gross. Yeah, yeah it was gross. Hey, what happened to the, to the kid? I don't know, and I don't care. I really don't want to know. <laughs> he's not my kid. I don't care. <laughs> well, I hope he's okay. <laughs> well, he's, if he's flashing pictures of it on Facebook, I'm assuming he is okay. <laughs> right? Oh, he's on Facebook, right. That's the first thing when I lose my leg. I'm, I'm going to do it. I like, get severely injured. I got my camera phone. Like, the paramedics are there. Like, we need to help. Like, what's that here? Wait! I need to pull my, need to pull my Facebook status. <laughs> Wait a minute, I need to put this on Pinterest. Yeah. <laughs> I need to pin it. I need to tweet it out. I'll get my phone to the paramedics. Be like, I need to Instagram yeah. this. Yeah. Wait, like, my leg is missing. Let me Instagram. Oh, you're like, kill me. What is that? Stop it. Your mic hit the cord. Oh, sorry. Is it better? No, worse. Oh, sorry. <laughs> is it better? Uh, uh, we'll touch it. You're good. Okay, I can't move now. The way I'm sitting is how I have to stay. This sucks. All right, so there's that interview he got, and actually the guy that did the the um, the character of Dan Emerson is actually um, an aspiring um, actor. 
I don't know. He's inspiring something. I read the interview I did. It was a good interview. Well, also, okay, I'm going to give you guys another link. And uh, for those of you who like these games, please ask me for a code. I have 299 of them. To use myself. I have Soul of Guardian Server 1 Starter Kit Giveaway event. They've opened up a new server. They have a new game. What is it? And it's for an MMO for a PC. I have, they give you like a starter kit to kind of boost your level 1 character. Like they. No, tell me what it is. Get, give me a, a lowdown of the game. Yeah. Oh my god, click the fucking link and then click that the link kidding. in it. <laughs> tell me, you should know. Well, I do. It's You're supposed to pitch this to us. No, I, I don't care. There's a lot. Now, they do these kind of giveaways all the time. Um, Soul of Guardians is a browser-based ARPG, a perfect combination of different cultures. It pictures a world of fantasy with lots of women with big boobs. It looks four, like RuneScape. Four classes of like characters, RuneScape. six guardian beasts with outstanding power, and two nations with st distinct what, goals. Like? Definitely a refreshing experience to your senses, and for you guys, a very refreshing experience for your eyes. Can I get some in-game pictures? Um, are you fucking serious? What the? Those graphics suck. Just kidding. <laughs> Looks a little better than RuneScape. It, no, it, it does. And actually, the, um, I was gonna say, the, uh, the starter giveaway kit actually includes a lot of stuff to help you along on your first few levels. So if anybody wants a code, just tell me. It's, it is yours. I have 299 of them. Um, the graphics look, they do look pretty good in the game though. So, um, RuneScape is like MySpace. No, MySpace is more popular. <laughs> Way popular. Oh, MySpace is like, oh my god. I can't think of a shitty enough social network to represent. It's true. It is true. But, um, MLG Blue is asking, what? How many did you start out with? Three hundred. <laughs> and today, um, somebody asked for one. What Ooh, is that fucking noise? That is. Yes. That's me taking this floss over my teeth. <laughs> Would you stop? <laughs> Wait, you're flossing? <laughs> I floss all the time. When I'm playing, I have like you know those floss picks. Yeah. Oh, I have boy. a pack of those that sit in front of me on my table when I'm gaming. So I'm, I'm flossing for like five hours a day when I'm on my computer or when I'm gaming. I'm, I just have one of those in my mouth. It's the only time my dentist likes me. Like, uh, floss. And he's always like, you need to floss more. No, Blue, the game actually, Blue, is not bad. I literally put that post up today. And I really haven't been promoting it, so. You should do it on Twitter. Yeah, I know Twitter I that. should. Twitter I mean, it. People on Twitter love codes. None of you fuckers in my channel do. No. <laughs> <laughs> I love these fuckers in my channel though. So I beat them. I do. They're good fuckers. Also, guys, the big contest that we have, I'm gonna link you. Nick, I actually want you to look because I don't look at it. You know Tell what? me it. Fucking please look at the picture. God. You're like God, if we were like near each other I'd fucking smack you across the head. Oh, the gas mask. I know about it already. I need to look at it. So, um, we've gotten a couple uh, entries in. Um, they're they're both pretty good. One's an interview. Somebody to interview. They're not even in the video, but they're doing the voices of the people from Metro Last Light being interviewed. Um, the other one um, is a musical. If you want to win, you have to draw the best looking dick. No, that's not true. <laughs> <laughs> If we... that, grabgaming.com, don't worry, and uh, <laughs> pick a winner. Robbie is the best judge, though. Robbie's going to be He's the judge of the, the best penis drawer. Yep. That's, that's fine. Good, Blue. And keep your video rated PG-13, because if it's not, it will not be shown. I don't want to see any penises, any vaginas, any naked asses. I don't want to see what? any... No. That's what... But like counts. No, because THQ is going to be looking at these. The community managers at THQ are actually going to help vote for it's the winner. Such a soft core position at the Jones. 
So, and, um, but we have more than one winner. I think we have five of these gas masks to give away. So there will be five winners and um, they will be picked uh, for five different reasons, you know. Um, best musical, maybe. Um, best use of lighting. Lighting, yes. <laughs> That's it. Let's be after for it there. No, but it'll be based the the funniest one. Um, you know, just we're just everybody's. We have five people that are going to win, and I'm hoping the closer we get, um, we are going to kind of start promoting this a, a little bit more because um, we only have like two weeks left of this contest. And the videos need to be uploaded to YouTube, and the link needs to be sent to me. And THQ is going to promote the video, so if you're looking to get some hits on your YouTube page, this is a good opportunity. So that's pretty awesome. I should do it. I think I'm too busy. You're, I know, but you're vice president here. You can't do it. <laughs> I quit. I'm doing it. <laughs> <laughs> He's so easily swayed. <laughs> Wow. Gas mask, beep beep. Mm, gas mask, win. You're a dick. You know that? You, you no. are. You're so mean to me. I'm not. You never are. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I'm the nicest person. I, I, yeah. In the world. I remember I got the first game. time you ever raged on me when we gamed. I was like. I don't remember it. I wasn't going to talk to you for. I didn't talk to you for like three days. And I was like, fuck him. He's a <laughs> fucking asshole. I'm going to delete him off my Xbox. That's probably like finally. <laughs> and I remember, I remember I actually told Rob, and Rob's like, really? He did that to you? I'm like, dude, he fucking left the party. He said his KD was sucking. It was so funny. I was so I, pissed at you. When was that? Oh, it was a long time ago. Yeah, it was. It was very long, long ago. Shinto ago. asks, um, will there be prizes besides the gas masks? Um, you can win Robbie. I don't know. Uh, the gas masks are pretty epic. They come in a little the carrying pouch they actually have filters extra filters in that little tin Do they um, work? yeah it's it's a working gas mask well i am definitely going to test that if it doesn't work i'm going to have a loss oh shut up if it doesn't work is it nick's going to try it and it doesn't work he dies yeah so <laughs> <laughs> oh boy but um kd it's like a 0.7 you know gobble yeah, his, his KD's pretty good. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, so I really do. Guys, get your videos in, you know. Um, and remember, though, if you make a video and then you decide you have you made a better one or you want a different one to submit, you can switch them out before. You can only submit one video, but you can switch one for another one if you want to. So if you make a different one. I'm still hoping somebody does a flash mob. I would fucking love to see that. That would be, like, the greatest thing ever. That would be pretty cool. That would be cool. Only because it's done well. If it sucked, that sucks. I don't care. If flash mob's a flash mob. I'll be happy. You know, I would like to see somebody, like, reenact their their little mini-movie they did for Metro Last Light, but, like, reenact it as, like, um, West Side Story. Stop giving them all them. Stop giving them ideas. You can't help them. I can. Or, like, be... no, like, reenact it, like... Cheating. Everyone. Like the, it. Like the Brady Bunch. But then, like, who would who would get the actual gas mask if they won? The person who made the video. Like the people, I guess that works. you know. Like we had, yeah. we've already had shit. I believe Shinto was. Um, was it you, Shinto, who submitted yours first? He interviewed, so he will win. He did the interview, so he will win the gas mask if that's who everybody votes for, and. Um, and, you know, he would win it for that. He's not even in the video, but whoever submits the video on their YouTube channel is who will win the gas mask. They can deal with other people after the fact if they use people. But, um... I'm gonna take Batman Begins trailer and upload it. Submit that. And <laughs> submit that. <laughs> Batman, whatever Batman is for him. <laughs> <laughs> so, see, I would, I would, I would, I'd like to see that mini-movie redone. That would be, that would be pretty cool, but redone. Like, re... Oh my god, redo it like early Star Trek, like dramatic like that. That would be fucking funny. I think I, I might have to get high and then watch them. You I'm joking, that? I don't get high at all. No, take it. Yeah. <laughs> so guys, please um, enter it, watch the video, get some ins I actually give you some inspirational ideas 
I said, you know, use... use cheating. Stop it's telling It's not me. cheating. I'm trying to inspire them. Inspiration cheating is very different. <laughs> oh, my God. It's not cheating. Who invited you on this fucking show? I don't know. Uh, green, <laughs> green Goalie on Twitter says hi. I know. Hi, Trust me. He could have been sweet. I know. I'd be right But Twitter. he told oh, me man. to say hi, so I'm doing what I'm supposed to. Fuck you, Green Goalie. God. I'm just kidding. He had a really good back tutorial on how to stream. Pretty good. Like, really Why didn't good. he just, like, come in? Him and I are like the FF. Not really. I've never met him, but he's cool. He is cool. I do know him. So, um, this is what else. Well, where's my news at? I just lost my whole page of news. God, this is tragic today. Just I told you I, I, news ready. I wasn't I wasn't ready for the show because I had TJ's baseball game and... Jesus. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> and then, oh, look it. Oh, my God. Your email to Warm Mart shipping from Hong Kong. I'm getting something from Hong Kong. Walmart. From Hong Kong. It's not Walmart. It's Warm Mart. R W A R M Mart. Sounds like Walmart. Huh? Nick, give me followers. Thank you, Twitter, for sending me screw time wow. uh, messages. Now. Nick has new followers. Um, I'm, a white I'm marksman uploaded. Uh, let's talk about um this new video that I just got in my email from you. It's called Modern Warfare 3 S and D C Town Rape. You yeah. <laughs> I put rape in the title because I figure I get more viewers. <laughs> um, I, I sell out pretty quick, you know. <laughs> so I'm going to actually, um, I'm going to link people to your channel. What is this new fucking ad shit they have on there? I hate it. What do you mean? They don't have any ads on my channel. There shouldn't be any. Well, there are. What are you talking about? There's none. I clicked on it. No, when I just loaded it, there's an ad that, there's a thing that says skip this ad. On my channel? Yes! No, there isn't. I'm on your fucking channel now. But you chose the wrong video. God, it says Modern Warfare 3 <laughs> S&D C-Town Rape. That's the one when you first log in and you have to click the thing. Trust me, it's there. It's a new it's thing. fucking out of my channel. That thing oh. is not partnered on purpose. Oh, my God. I argue. You need to come on every week so I can argue with you. Guys, go check out Nick's video. Only um, one of my... There's like maybe three of my videos that should have ads on them. And that's because I use copyright music. I tried to... Dispute the copyright claim because it's a mashup and not the original song. Nick has a voice for being a commentator. I've always said this. I love it when he's commentating because he's really good at it. Deleting this video from my channel. Fuck you, copyright. You're not. So, the, oh, look, look, look at him go. He's so fast, it's like he's on fucking speed. <laughs> he talking? I talked pretty quick in that last video. I was, like, really behind. Wow, look at that shot on him. Nick, like, hunts people down. He doesn't even wait for them to get... Oh, there he comes. He's off to the right. Watch. Oh. He's good, guys. Watch this video and learn. You will be educated. MLG Blue says, you guys need your own reality <laughs> TV show. You guys argue so much. I don't argue. Shinto says, if you use copyright music, you'll be put with ads. I know. I just deleted my, only one video, though, ever. Right. Had copyright music. They only have the rights to put ads on that one video. I deleted the video, too, because it had copyright. It's a good video. I like it. It will go up tomorrow morning with the others, with your Skyrim video as well. But um, other, other shit in news is... Um, Mr. DJ Arcus finally gets another game up on PC. Also, um, Fortress Fortress Craft is coming to PC via OnLive soon. He, OnLive? OnLive, O-N-L-I-V-E. It's just a, a place where you can download the game from. Um, as, I thought it was called... I thought that, is that the thing that was made by... It's like that emulator, almost? Uh, it's kind of... It's kind of like Steam, kind yeah, of. Yeah, it's kind of like Steam, but it's on live. But it's on... O-N-L-I-V-E, that's the name of it. I know, it. and it's orange and black is their yes, logo? Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I, bet the, the, I bet those guys are free again also. They're, they have a really cool emulator that can represent or can, like, dupe Xbox games almost. Not really a dupe, but, like... Yeah, no, well, I think rights, that's why so. he went with them, because Fortress Craft is obviously on... Xbox, yeah. so he went with them, and we're hoping that soon it will be 
available for I say so we because I am their social media coordinator. So yeah, I am kind of trying to push his games. <laughs> Because <laughs> the more he sells, the more I make. <laughs> so, straight commission awesome. people, bye, bye, bye. But um, <laughs> <laughs> but um, so he actually um, as well, Steam Harrows is on IndieCity.com, and that was that's also it's a little social game. If you're a social gamer, you like Bejeweled Blitz and stuff like that. Steam Harrows. It does have achievements. If you have, if you get Steam Harrows on Xbox you get a free Harrison Axe code for Fortress Craft, and the PC version will not have that option. So, But um, it does have 32 achievements on the PC and as well on Xbox. I didn't know this when I first started playing it, and then I found out there was achievements, and I was like, maybe I'll go, like, but it's, I, it fucking pisses me off. I, I will admit I raged on it. It's like raging on Be Bejeweled Blitz, so I was, like, kind of feeling stupid, and I didn't tell anybody for a long while. But I raged. I did rage on Steam Heroes. But, um, so yes, um, he's very happy about that going. There's a lot of things. I'm actually quoted in this, um, in this press release as well. And so I was excited about that. But, um, wait, if somebody's talking channel, wait, Steph, why does the M word in the last game? Um, my kids play, um, Minecraft. And so I will say it, and that's fine. I don't tell them they can't play it. They like holy it. shit, that was sketchy as hell. Wow. I couldn't figure out why there was this little white part by the chat. It's the dude's hand under the picture. Right. I was fucking <laughs> sketching out. I was looking at like what is wrong with my computer. There's this white <laughs> dot on the chat corner, and I was like, I opened up three different windows to figure out, I was like, is it on this color scheme too? What the hell's wrong? Oh, I finally wrong? figured out it was the background picture. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, was just, I, I was free, I was like, what is that? Why is it there? Oh, that's so funny. Who's on crack? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> We're not saying any names. No. Nick's and crack. <laughs> But, um, but yeah, so, so everybody, it would help. Also, I'm actually um, going to put together a promotion or something with Fortress Craft as soon as he has it on PC so we can involve PC people and on Xbox, and it will have to do, I don't know, we're going to have some kind of, I'm going to try to get um, maybe um, our friends at Play and Trade to help me um, donate maybe an Xbox or a PS3 to this contact, for this contest that has to do with Fortress Craft, so... We're going to have people building stuff, and a console is going to be the prize. We're still I'm still putting that together. It's somewhere down the line, but that's going to be maybe on our two-year anniversary. That's something we'll do. So everybody can be ready for that. Um, Nick, do you have anything coming up you want to talk about? Any events you're going to? Oh, what was that? PAX East, you're going to go with Rebel Gaming? Oh, my God, that's so amazing. <laughs> He's away. He's talking to his roommate again. So Shinto says, really? And yes, Shinto, really. Um, no, you're right, Blue. You're not allowed to say it in chat because I don't want to promote um, what's his name and his game. I'd rather promote DJ Arcus and Fortress Craft because, yeah, I am a little bit partial to it. He's my employer. He pays me. <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. It doesn't it, though? <laughs> <laughs> so, um, so, but, um, oh, I know people, um, a lot of people, yeah, um, Ireland uh, is one of them. Another country is the same way. They don't have indie games on their Xboxes in those countries. So this is why it is coming to PC soon, and everybody that can't play it on the Xbox will be able to play it on PC. I will as well be playing it on PC and, uh, We'll, we'll do a contest for the PC and for the Xbox. Um, I'm probably going to be honest with you, being that it is coming to the PC, I might do the bigger contest for the PC version. Beca that makes sense. Because we want to sell stuff. You know what I mean? We want we want to get games sold, so... <laughs> exactly. And I mean, it, it is only... I think it's only like 280 Microsoft points for Fortress Crap. And he does... Russell, 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 Pete's I'm back, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and he does updates for it like all the time. Who like, does? 
Oh, what? DJ Arcus from Fortress Craft. Like, literally, like, every week there's a new update. He fixes something, or he, somebody will tweet to him an idea, and he'll add it to the game. He also has another it's game coming out called Fortress Craft 2D. And... That's Notch. I know Notch, bro. What's that? No, I'm not talking about Notch. So what... I um, Notch. I'm checking out Fortress Craft now. What kind of separates it from that other game? Minecraft, um, the difference is, is there's, it's, zombies don't come and kill you, you don't die, there's, um... That's no fun. There's, no, but the difference is, though, it's more, if you're into, like, things like SimCity and, um, games like okay. that, Fortress Craft is probably right up your alley. At first, I was kind of the same, like, like what's the difference? But he has a, um, I forget what it's called. I hope he's not listening because he's going to kill me. Um, there's an area where you can actually craft your own blocks. You can make your own designs. And so for people that kind of like to develop, that, you know what I mean? A lot of the people are kind of on ground level. I would say, like, almost developing. You can make your own objects and stuff for it. And, uh, that's cool. and, and that's, if you like games like SimCity... Um, along that lines, I that's I I got in Fortress Craft and I actually started building my own kind of town in my level, and then I lost my first house somewhere in my map and I can't find it, so I built another one. <laughs> 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 but um, but uh, well, that's it's... what Minecraft's missing, really. It is missing like, hey, I died. I want to teleport back to my house. Yeah. Nobody quit Minecraft. He was so butthurt. He couldn't get back to his home. Are you serious? <laughs> well, that's that's pretty funny. <laughs> but, um, but no, there's a lot of, you can do um, a lot of your own crafting in it. Like I said, I, he's going to kill me because he's going to go stuff me. I was listening to your show last night. You did not describe Fortress Craft well. Uh huh. And, and, but there's, um, when you first spawn in the game, um, there's there's an area where you can actually craft your own like blocks. That's the easiest way to describe it. Um, he he's on chapter one now. Chapter two he is working on, and he said that yes, it chapter Fortress Craft chapter two will be out. He's also having Fortress Craft 2D, which is somewhere in the line of the story of Fortress Craft. I don't know where it is in that line of games because he's kind of doing like a Star Wars thing. He's skipping to the back and then back to the front. I don't know. He confuses me sometimes. <laughs> so I won't lie, he does. <laughs> I have Fun. to, I have to ask him to like repeat things sometimes. I'm like, what? <laughs> what did you just say? Um, but um, there's really not um, like a good uh, description. It it is different in the fact it's more of if you like to craft things, um, Fortress Craft is good for you. If you like SimCity games that have you building and um, making your own shit. You'll like Fortress Craft. You don't die. There's a day and a night there. There's water. It's um, it's similar that way. Um, it looks cool. I'm checking out like a like video of it. But like I said, it's it's only 280 Microsoft points. and um, so. But when it comes to PC, I, the other thing though I'm looking forward to is... Oh, I've heard of Minecraft 800. Ridiculous. 800 Microsoft points for Minecraft, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, something like that. And I thought it was stupid. more than that. It was like 16... Are you serious? Yes, actually it is. Um, it is 240 Microsoft points for Fortress Craft on Xbox Live. So I'm sure the same price will be reflected on PC as well. But he said... He did tell me, though, that... Um, that um, or I was actually watching a video of him today because he doesn't tell me when he does shit. So I have to find these things out on my own that, you know, there are different aspects for it being on PC that require, obviously, different things. But um, if, you go to, if you go to FortressCraft.com, it does actually show you some of the shit some of the people have built in this, and it is quite um, amazing. And he does have Content Patch 10 up on there, and it tells you what he is fix they actually have a game in it they play it's called spleef spleef mode i don't know what this is but it's very popular and a lot of people are playing it in this game and i guess i need to find out more about it because i mean i didn't realize but people are actually making videos and i'm missing the whole train on it so being that it's part of my job to promote it i probably should know more about it um but he also put in this nice content patch 32 player online games 
No, oh, no, there was something else. Somebody said he has like a 64 mode, which is more than Minecraft. It's one of the press releases. So, but, um, but the screenshots of it are pretty, I think, pretty good. It's got a good following. It's a good game for 240 Microsoft points. I mean, what the fuck? You can't. You could buy that with your leftover points from buying another game. So go buy it. There you go. You know? Right, exactly. If anybody does get it on Xbox, let me know, though. I'd love to um, play it with you. So, but, well, Spleef is as well in Fortress Craft, so, but their Spleef is a little bit different if you watch the videos from Fortress Craft. It's pretty cool, what I I've seen. I destroyed that pizza. Did you destroy the pizza? Everybody? Destroyed the pizza. I'm Marksman has destroyed yeah. the pizza. It's gone. <laughs> Delicious. Minecraft's too expensive. 20 bucks is a joke. I should buy it, take a picture of it while I'm buying it, and send it to Marcus on Skype. Be like, you're welcome. No. Sorry, Notch, if you don't know. Marcus, whatever. Yeah, well, DJ Arcus is actually Adam, if you didn't know. So, I don't know. I didn't. I remember you told me his name, and I was like, shit, well, I don't know his name. Yeah, you should. So he also has um, another game coming out. He has, like, he actually has about ten different games in development. Um... And that's the one that he's been talking over with Nick. And that's, um, I love the music for this video. I wish I could find it. Um, it's called Tactics Forever, I believe it is. That's the link I gave you, right, Nick? When we were talking I about this? I don't even remember. Well, you don't. You don't remember anything I ever talked to you about. I remember, like, stuff about a day ahead of time. Or yeah. a day after. Well, you, s- you suck. That's why. But yeah, the- partially. <laughs> you do. But Tactics Forever is very cool because, see, I think I think I'm getting to know a little bit about Mr. Arcus here. He's this game is also a game kind of if you like The Sims, Sim City stuff like that, you're gonna like this game. You have to build a ship and you have to fight the computer to win. And if your ship sucks ass, then the computer wins. I could see myself raging on this because I'd be like, "Fuck that! I know I hit the ship," but um. But yeah, no, he does. He already has about um, nine games on Xbox Live, actually. Or or he has nine games. He has quite a few games. He's been doing this for a long time. That's his I... Tactics, for, Tactics Forever video. Um, watch it. It's actually really good. Um, I'm trying to think. No, he has five, five games on Xbox Live, and he has about, I don't know. He, he'll tell you he has probably hundreds of games in development. You know, nine in real life and the rest are in his head. But Tactics Forever looks cool. I could, um, I could play this. I could see this becoming addicting. One of those stupid addicting games. Because I would, I would have to beat the computer. I turn it on the Xbox. Let's game. Oh, God. Not really playing right now. Maybe. But I, I, hopefully oh, everybody's, yeah. everybody's watching this. And going, oh my god. Except for Nick, who's starting the game. But I am actually going to... While you guys are watching that, I just want to... Oh, wrong wrong click stuff. Duh. I'm an idiot. Don't agree to that, anybody. It's like randomly dying and shit. Um, I'm scrolling down to THQ News. Um... WWE 13 gets stone cold with special collector edition announced. If I played that, I might be excited about it. Did you see, did anybody see this review on GameSpot by this patcher dude? It says, Wii U isn't going to work. Oh, wow. Yeah, he like, I saw it on Twitter as well. I just saw it in my news. And this is from GameSpot. I'm going to um click, give you guys the link. Yes, Lou, also. I was looking at the chat. So... Notch is a streamer on Twitch, so I okay, well, help him out. Yeah, but you also said that you would help out DJ Arcus as well. Stop no, trying. I'm not saying I would. Lou was just asking if I had Notch on Skype. I said, yeah, if he needs help, he sends me a message and I help him out. So, but so with Arcus, I sent him a message is, today. He hasn't responded yet. I know, he probably, he probably, yeah, he probably was away. But um, yeah, that was the article. This morning, I, I saw spammed on Twitter a lot, and it says Wii U isn't going to work. And 
And I know I I don't know why I didn't read the article, but everybody was bitching about it. So I thought that that was some pretty hot news, maybe. What is? Um, about this Wii U. This this article was spammed all over Twitter today. Wii U? Yes. Oh, I didn't know about it. You don't know anything about it because you live in your little fucking bubble world. What is the Wii U? <laughs> Is it going to work? That's some random guy I've never heard of. No, on GameSpot, but that's a pretty good GameSpot's site. GameSpot's a pretty big partner with us, too. I didn't even know. Yeah, duh. See? It says Web, 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 Web Bush Securities Analyst Michael Patcher. So he must be like an official dude because he's an analyst. Has oh, offered man. has offered some harsh words about Nintendo's forthcoming Wii U console, saying during a developed conference presentation last week via Edge that the system plainly isn't going to work. I don't get it, he said. I think that essentially this is a solution in search of a problem. Basically, um, let's make the controller a tablet. Blah, blah, blah. And he's, he's not for it. He's Activision never said anything to me, he explained, but I know that for big games like Call of Duty, they said, no, we're not putting it on there if you don't give us a conventional controller. So they gave in. So I guess there's going to be a controller along with the Wii U. That's fucking retarded. Well, they showed it off at their, uh, their conference. They had like a smaller conference before the E3 one. And they showed the Pro Controller. It looks like a big Xbox controller. Right. Um, which I'm, I'm, a, I'm a fan of because, unfortunately, not every game is going to utilize this. So... It's good to have an option, I guess, because um, the last thing you want to do is have them, you know, kind of finagle right. something in there and it just doesn't work out. You know, the game ends up sucking. Um, I mean, he has like a couple of points here. I think he's a little heavy handed, but it, I, I do agree with what he was saying about, uh, you know, a solution in search of a problem. There's some things in the design of the Wii U that I'm like, like a huge question mark. Like, why would you do it that way? Um you know, it's it's cool to like be innovative, but if if it's not really solving a problem, if it's not really bringing anything new to the table that's uh, usable um, against other products, it doesn't really it doesn't really work. Like for instance, the way they're doing the uh, oh, you know, online. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Okay, go ahead. like the way they're doing the online chatting thing, where like you can, you know. It's it's cool to an extent where you can contact people via their phones or uh, you know you know type of message and it'll like bubble up a, a top of the game and you can see what, how they felt about it and all that good stuff. But then you think like if if I could just chat to the person, it would be much easier uh, than you know doing all this runabout you know that they're doing. And apparently they're keeping you know the, those long friend codes um, that they have from before. It's right. like there's some things that. I really like, I really like, you know, Mario, I really like Pikmin, I like what they've shown with uh, Raymond Origins, I, I really like it, and I want, I mean, I'm going to buy it, because I'm a Nintendo fan, boy, but, <laughs> <laughs> you know, but, but at the same time, it's like, uh, it's like you really, you feel kind of bad for them, and so, because they're, you know, one thing that um, Reggie really made me upset was when he was like, you know, we can't please everyone, and I'm like, you're not pleasing, you're, you're pleasing very small group of people um let's let's be honest you're not trying to please everyone because that's the case you would change the way that you're doing some of the things that you're doing no one should have to force you to make a pro controller you know what i mean right if well that's the other article i just found um and it says that um activision basically forced them um to make it says right here um and it was done by a site I've never heard of before, SeekingAlpha.com. It says Activision Blizzard investors might be... Oh, no, that's the other one. Sorry. I had that one up, too. Here it is. Um, wait, wait, wait. Where'd it go? I, don't, I just saw one. It just basically... They said that Activision forced them the, to make a controller for it. Now, and you know, I, I, I don't necessarily believe that that was the case, but... I do feel that they chose to make the pro controller not because they necessarily wanted to, but because they didn't want to miss out on third-party games. And that's the kind of thinking that I think is is kind of wrong with with the way they're doing stuff now. Um, you know, like it's like we we watch the uh, E3 you know press conference, right. or whatever, 
and you see them go on and on and on about, you know, like Nintendo Land. But, you know, behind closed doors, they had Zelda and they had uh, Fire Emblem and they had all this other stuff. And it's like, you, you didn't even have to show the game, just show the name and people would have lost their minds. You know, it's like they're coming from, you know, like, it's almost like they're going backwards. Right. Let's, let's, let's make it. And then when people start, you know, feeling some kind of way about it, oh, oh, yeah, we're also going to bring this in. It's like, no, show that first. Right. You know, there's no, there's no price, there's no release date, but it's supposed to come out this year. Yeah. You know, <laughs> it's, it's, it's those things that are kind of like this discerning. And even from a big Nintendo guy, like, I'm the one, you know, if, if anybody listens to our podcast, I'm the guy who's always defending Nintendo, and I'm like, I, I kind of agree with everyone, you know, and, and, you know, I'm still going to buy it, but still, like, <laughs> I, I agree, like, there's some things that I think design-wise and, and marketing-wise that they, they really should go a different route, and I'm not saying to be like Sony or like Microsoft, you can still be unique, but, you know, when you create something, make sure there's a need for it first, you know, right? and, and before you put all your chips in there, you know, because... You know, a lot of people bought the weed, um, you know, outside of, you know, the grandmas and whatnot. A lot of people that I know, it's, it's kind of collecting dust now because they don't want to use the motion controller or, you know, they, they don't want to hand me down Call of Duty. You know, they, they want to play some of the other titles with those other features. Um, you know, I, I think Nintendo should really, really think about how they're going to market their system and how they're going to push the third-party games because, personally, I wasn't excited about the you know batman arkham city with armor that, that right doesn't, you know although i do love zombie U. I think that's going to be awesome but that was that was my rant <laughs> that was your rant oh i think we just lost nick i am so here so you're not <laughs> all right well i guess we're gonna um actually wrap it up and uh <laughs> i just um if y'all didn't know i just um I muted Blue and Channel because he was dissing what we were talking about. This is why we have Rebel Live. Not only, we don't just talk about Blue's favorite shit. Because if we did, we'd be talking about him jerking off in a corner all day. So that said, I I have... Oh, you know what we didn't even talk mm -hmm. about tonight? <laughs> no, everybody, last Next week... Time. No, last, time. last week we were supposed to... We said that this week we were going to talk about Pokemon and retro no. gaming. Can't do it now. We can't because now we're going to leave because, oh, <laughs> Shinto's upset. You guys have to remind me, next week we need to talk about Pokemon <laughs> in detail. Pokemon is a shit. Perfect. And we all agree that. Leave it for the morning. By the way, I am awesome. developing with Barry a morning, um, a morning talk show, and it, we have decided on a title. It will be called Rebel Morning Wood. Nick, how do I un <laughs> how do I unban people in here? Or, uh, or... forward slash unban the username. Okay. Thank you. See, that's why Nick is around. Does yep. what he does. Unban is it just unban or unbanning? Oh or anything? my god, I'll get it here. Blue. <laughs> <laughs> can you unban Blue, All please, right. so he can say goodbye to us? <laughs> So, did you unban him? Yeah. All right. Done. Thank you. Blue, you can talk now. He probably left. <laughs> no, he's still here. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, so um, we're going to call it uh, Rebel Morning Wood, and that's going to be um, co-hosted with um, Barry, so it's very fitting um, that it's titled as such because Barry will be with us, and, and he's usually naked when he is on air with us. And um, awesome. Barry is awesome. He had he was really good on last night. So we got on on the zombie show last night too. He stayed up. He went, he took a nap and then he woke up so that he could be on with us. And they stayed up till like four in the morning, I believe it was. Um, wow. Yeah. So, oh, we love you, Blue. I just, I have to fuck with you. Like it wouldn't be the same if I didn't. <laughs> so, <laughs> but um. But thank you, Nick, a.k.a. I'm Marksman, for joining us and, and arguing with me. It's always fun. You know I love you and that I argue with you because I can. So <laughs> thank you, Kenny, for joining us. 
Um, you should capitalize Mondays in your description. It bothers me. Does it really? Well, I'm it a is. Nazi. Oh, no, in my description down below. I don't think I did that one. Like where it says info? Mm-hmm. Then you fucking change it. God. <laughs> you're, All the, right. you're the fucking vice president here. Do something. Everybody <laughs> say goodnight to Nick. He's leaving. He has to go game and piss people off. Yep. Peace out. Good night. Later, Nick. All right, later, Nick, and thank you all for joining us. Um, I know tonight was very random. It was kind of off the cusp. I was pulling things from here and there. So um, next week we'll go back to – I didn't show any pictures. Usually I do, and I didn't have, like, anything anything ready tonight. Um, please don't forget the Metro Light um, – uh, Metro Last Light Contest. Guys, get your videos in. Um, when you do, tweet it out. Tweet at THQ and Metro. Um, I think it's Metro Video Game is their Twitter account. And so they can retweet it as well. And um, Kenny, you're welcome to join us anytime. You know that. Just give me a heads up that you want to come on and we'll dial you in. Um, you got something to promote, let us know too because I'm not one of those sites that um, you know, I'm. we all get traffic. So if you got something to promote, let us know and give you a shout out about it. And um, but yeah, also on the website, hopefully this week we'll have a new website up. When we do, we're gonna also have um, gaming nights where we'll be giving away stuff as well, so people can join us on Xbox or PS3 and game with us. We'll have open lobbies, and that'll be a lot of fun. But we're gonna let um, our community pick the games. We're gonna give them like a selection of games, and they can pick what game, and whatever game gets picked is the game that we will play that night. Nice. Okay. So um, you can join us on that too, Kenny. Why not? Awesome. Well, thanks <laughs> for having me. <laughs> and thank I you. Have... Thank you for being here, even though it was very, like I said, I was very unprepared tonight. I literally had like three minutes to get ready for the show. So um, No problem. I'll try to check in uh, next Monday just to see, you know. Absolutely. See if it was well, you're always better. welcome. Awesome. You take care. You too. Good night, everybody. Good night.